Hello, this is XXFadeZZ, and today I'll be doing a tutorial on how to make Windows 7 look like an Alienware computer. So, let's get started. This is kind of what it looks like. Okay, so, I'll show you. I'll tell you about it later. First of all, I'll show you how to get it. Okay, there'll be a link in the description. So, yeah, let's type it in here. But it should be in the description. Just go go to this website and click on download. And here it says um times eighty six and times sixty four. If you have a thirty two bit computer, you do times eighty six. If you have a sixty four bit computer, do times sixty four. And to check that, right click on computer right here. Properties and it'll we'll show it right here. So mine's a 64. So I'll click on 64. Should download, should start. If it doesn't, go back and click it again. I had to do that once. Okay, so now you have it. You don't need to extract it or anything, you just gotta click on it. Double click. Click yes. Let it open. And this. Okay, so next and accept. Next and make sure all of these are checked or it won't give you one. So yeah, and then click install. So since I already have it, I'm not gonna click it, but you just click install and then go next. And then after you install, you'll have to reboot your computer or else it won't take any effect. So yeah, you do that. And come back here to this video, and here, and I'll show you how to what's it like, what it's like stuff. Okay, so when you do it, you want to make sure you want to go to personalize, right click on your computer, and go to personalize, and make sure you're on this theme right here. Just make sure you click it. After that, if you don't like the background, the background will be like this. You just Click on what I did, the desktop background, and go through, find one you like. I like this one, obviously, but these come with it once you restart it, they should be there. So you just pick one you like. This one, some cool ones down here, like that, and that. But yeah, pick one, I like this one. So I'm gonna keep that, okay, and so yeah, that should be set. And whenever you do it, whenever you get it, you should have this new bar down here. In the bar, you can just put whatever you want on it. Just like add whatever. Just add that. Don't want it? So yeah. And whenever you first get it, right click on it and do dock settings. And I recommend you click check this one. Load Alienware dock at startup. So yeah, that way it'll always be there. And oh, this is what the folders, I guess, the libraries look like. All this stuff, and then new icons for everything, and all that stuff. And you highlight it. It's always highlighted red whenever you click on something. So yeah, it's pretty cool. New icons, recycling bin and stuff, and okay, and something that tricked me at first is in your start menu. Whenever you want to search something on your start menu, there's no box you click. It's kind of like gone. So to do it, you just type. You don't even click anywhere. So you just type word. Just word. You don't have to find some. Get lost trying to find it. Look it up. Just type it. You don't need to click on any box. So, yeah. What else is there? Um, on your icons. Not really that much, but yeah. It's pretty cool. And then the taskbar, giant clock. And yeah, it's really awesome. And, alright, so I hope it works. If it doesn't, um, like the first time I did it, 
my taskbar is messed up, so I just went to my uninstall installer, and I went here, and I did William, and you just uninstall it, and then go back to the link and reinstall it. That worked for me. It's what I had to do, and I worked after. So yeah, um, if it doesn't work, do that. And yeah, hope it works for you. And if it doesn't, I'm sorry, but I don't really know how to fix it. So all right, that this is XX Phase Z out. And please subscribe. Hope you liked the video. Hope it worked. All right, later.